back. At the end of every show, I like to share something amazing from the world of social media. This is called What I'm Liking. Get it, band. My audience today is first responders who always remind us, don't take the law into your own hands. Isn't that right? Yeah. Right? OK. OK. Well, you guys might make an exception for this one woman. She's awesome. Check her out. To get speeders on her street to slow down, a granny from Montana sat outside her house and held up her hair dryer as a radar gun. She even brought a be beverage, which I think is awesome. That's my girl. Um, her name is Patty, and she thinks she's about to Skype with my producers. So let's go ahead and surprise her. Hopefully she voted for me, not Justin. It's cool. Hi, Patty. I'm Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> First of all, Patty, I just want to say I think you're hilarious and one of my favorite people. Where did you get this idea? Well, we live on Flathead Lake, and we're very close to Glacier National Park, so we get a lot of tourists going around on our road, and they fly by. So we just thought one day we would, or my son thought he'd put me up on the road and give me a... <laughs> hair dryer and pretend it was a <laughs> radar gun. Oh my God. And I, I love it. Well, I understand this caught the attention of law enforcement, right? But in a good way. It did. Uh, the Montana trooper had tracked me down through social media, found where we lived, and came down and surprised me. I thought I was going to be in trouble, but he <laughs> said he wanted to make me an honorable trooper and gave me a little hat and a little badge. Did he, I love it. Did, he, cute. <laughs> did you finally get a real radar gun or are you just still gonna use the hair dryer? <laughs> yeah, I don't think they'd give me the radar gun. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Patty. We love you. We thought it was so funny. You made my day when I saw this. I'm gonna officially like your post. And I just wanna thank all my guests, John Cena, Shoma Josie, and a big thank you to all the first responders and people who serve in uniform who joined me today. We thank you for your service to our communities and to our country.